Whoa, I'm Troy Mayer's the Power Pack, and today I'm really thankful for the ABCDs of fall protection. Right now, I'm most interested in step D, which stands for descent and rescue. Anytime now. When I get out of this, we'll start from the beginning. It is good to be back in here because today we're talking the ABCDs of fall protection. Now A is for anchor point. Anchor points are required to support at least 5,000 pounds per worker attached to it. As a point of reference, you should be able to hang two 1995 Toyota Corollas from the anchor point. I don't know what you'll do with that information, but now you've got it. B is for body support. When correctly worn, a harness will distribute the force caused by the fall to prevent any one part of your body from taking the full force of the fall. Now C is for connected device. Now this could be an SRL, it could be an SRD, or in my case today, shock absorbent lanyard. Fortunately, these devices continue to get more and more advanced. They include things like breakaway sections or shock packs, all to better protect the fallen worker. And finally, the often forgotten D. Now most people stop their planning at C, but D is just as important because D stands for descent and rescue. Now, if a worker were to fall and A, B, and C all work, that's great. Now you need to get him down. It's important to have an emergency response plan in place and that all workers are trained on fall rescue. And that's gonna be it. Those are the ABCDs of fall protection. Thank you for watching today. Comment below how you would visualize 5,000 pounds if it weren't two Toyota Corollas. And until next time, stay safe.